now. Christy Phillips on the floor exercise. Starting out with the full end back somersault in the pike position was a little low, but that's something Christy, she's so coordinated. Those low landings, she can just bring them around and make them look good. Christy's personality is something that she can work with. She works with the crowd, and as you can notice, her floor music is something that gets the crowd involved. You can clap to it. And Bella specifically picked that music for Christy. Well, at 16, her biological clock has changed. A young woman now, taller, heavier, as you mentioned. That's a new pass for Christy. Performs it quite easy, too. Yes, she is dealing with a totally new body. Similar to the same thing that Tracy Talavera went through years back. The defending national champion, Christy Phillips, from Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Back with Caroli. Why? I really needed to change my motivation. I was kind of depressed, you know, going in and doing the same thing every day, you know, for four years is a long time. And so I felt that, you know, I needed to change out there. And once I went out there, you know, we weren't getting hardly as, not half as many hours as we were at Caroli's. And so I felt that, you know, I was kind of slacking off and I wasn't, you know, I could, there's no way I could get where I wanted to get on 20, 26 hours a week. So I really needed to go back to Bella's and start working harder and about 40 hours a week. So. It was a lot different. A uh, 9.45, a disappointing score. When you're in 10th place, that's just a holding score, not one that will move her up in the standings. Oh, what a huge difference a year makes. And we'll be back with more of the McDonald's U.S. Gymnastics Championships.